Some members of the clergy in Montego Bay, St. James, today came out in full support of retaining the Bugri law. Several clergymen publicly declare they will not support the government if the Bugri law is repealed. Sandy Shippey reports. The men are seeking to get 150,000 persons to sign a declaration in favor of keeping the law on Bugri. At the monthly meeting of the St. James Minister's Fraternal this morning, its chairman, Glendon Powell, argued that removing the law on Bugri may wipe out what's left of Jamaica's moral fabric. If they repeal this Bugri law, the health system is going to be pressed. It is going to bring about violence. According to Mr. Powell, the church has a responsibility to carry the voice of the people Wumi says are concerned about how removing the law will affect their lives. He argues the government should not be pressured into changing the way the society is organized. We will continue in our effort to stand on the principles that we are saying to the leaders of our country that they will not, they should not seek to revise this law. Another member of the clergy in Montego Bay, Phil Gordon, says it's no time for the government to explain its position on the issue. The move comes just a week after the Constitutional Court heard a case against three Jamaican stations which refused to air a commercial promoting tolerance for gays. Sandy Shippey, TVJ News.